the way to the other side of the island, we are going to be visiting Aloha Animal Sanctuary. So we haven't been there, it's going to be a first time. And let's see what is so for us. Oh no, I thought something. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna be taking care of pigs, goats, and dogs in cows. And I have a cow right here beside me. So all the animals that were saved, and we've been really wanting to visit that place. I thought something happened. Oh my God. So this girl right here is pregnant. Her name is Elsa. Pua, Anna, and Pua Waipanu. The name is Waipanu. What about this little girl here? <laughs> so when they were rescued, the, we didn't know she was pregnant. <laughs> oh, you didn't know she was pregnant? So it was a surprise. So she's new here. Yeah, they moved in maybe like two months ago, I think. Oh, just two months ago. And when are you gonna give birth, Elsa? 
Any day now. Oh, well, any day. Oh, look at that. Yeah. It's good that you're here. Yeah. I'm She's gonna, gonna have her baby safe. Yeah, I mean her babies. Um, what it just been a part so of. So they were rescued from dairy. They were supposed to be slaughtered, but they were saved and they were brought here. And they found out that she's pregnant. And she's going to give birth anytime soon. You see that pregnant belly? And I like her collar all. Try collar. Yeah. How, how often do they eat today? Um, twice a day. But then um, they... They eat morning and... At night. night. Yeah, so we come um, in the morning and then there's an evening shift. And they so there's a lot of different ways that you can contribute to the success of the Aloha Animal Sanctuary. Uh, we are 100% ran by volunteers. Um, donating their time and their money. There are no paid positions here at the sanctuary. Um, so in order to be able to rescue and rehabilitate more uh, animal residents, we rely on people contributing um, either on Venmo or PayPal. There's other opportunities as well. Um, you can contribute to our barn that we're making for our pigs so they have a nice solid permanent residence um, in preparation for hurricane season <laughs> and to give them shade from the hot Hawaiian sun. Um, on our website at alohasanctuary.org uh, you can see the different ways of donating. You can actually sponsor an animal which is a really great way to build a connection with a particular animal so for as little as ten dollars a month you can actually sponsor our chickens, our uh, goats, our ducks um, for about $20, $25 a month, you can help support our pigs as well. So that goes to not only food and general care and maintenance for the animal and their living environments, but also um, to medical costs. Just the other day, we had um, one of our uh, ducks, Luna, she had difficulty with um, an egg. And unfortunately, that can be a really dire situation if they're not able to actually lay their egg. So we were able to take her to the hospital. She's doing great now, but we came back with like a $400 bill. Mm -hmm. So something like that, of course, is definitely important. And we need to be able to take our animal residents to the hospital when they have a medical emergency. Um, but we also need to be able to pay the bills so we can keep things running smoothly and keep all of our animals happy and healthy. So if you just go to our website at alohasanctuary.org, you can help contribute to the happiness and well-being of all of our animal residents here. I hope you enjoyed it.